Hello everybody, welcome back to another Minecraft Let's Play video. This is going to be another video inside of my Minecraft realm. And I officially named my realm Nightcraft. So from now on I'm going to be saying another video inside of Nightcraft after this episode. So yeah, today we are going to go to Nether to get lots of Nether Quartz because I need Nether Quartz to build a storage room which will go here, or maybe here. Um, I'll have a storage room to basically organize my stuff and just um, stow stuff in there. It's things I don't need. So yeah, let me just ask them if they're ready. Anyway, so what I have on me is a few tools. I don't have too many things in my inventory. Um, because I will be filling up most of my inventory with quartz, because I feel like I do need a lot of them to build the storage room. I mean, it depends on how big it is. Um, but anyway, so, let me just put stuff in that I do not need. Maybe this book, this paper, that uh, coal, door. I don't know, I guess that's it. Some weapons, and maybe this fishing rod. I do not want to, in case if I die, um... I do not want to lose all my valuables. Well, I do have lots of valuables with me. Um, like diamond armor and, and diamond tools, but really, I store my diamonds in my chest. So, hold on. this should be a fun video for you guys to watch us going to nether the new nether um because of the nether update um fighting monsters you know just having a good time <laughs> mining quartz so yeah and if you don't know um netherrack actually exists in the overworld and also every time i see another portal like there's this obsidian pool of lava so I think they're in another. Hold on. Alright, let's go in another. Since they're already in. Oh boy, I'm pumped for this. Right, so it looks like they're here with us. And check this out, guys. Um, I don't remember these binds, but there's a lot of stuff that got added in another update. So we just gotta be careful. And I'll just take a screenshot of where my nether portal is so we don't lose it. Because that'd be devastating. Oh boy, this is really scary. Oh man, if I fall, like if I fall there, I'm going all the way down to that lake. Which is I, which is something I do not want to happen. I just gotta, you, you just gotta watch your step whenever you are in the nether. And I think we should also get this glowstone as well. Um, seeing that um, we can get glowstone dust and have a light source. Besides torches, and there's like a little piglin trying to get Julia. So yeah, we just kill, killed him. Anyway, we got some gold in the nether. Oh, uh, I got spare food. Um, just in case they forgot food, I got lots of food on me. So, seems like there's a lot of nether quartz, but to get there... Yeah, it's going to be a huge drop. Hold on, let me just try to get there as safely as I can. There we go. I don't know. I, I do not have lots of blocks, but I do have a diamond pickaxe, which can mine all this nether rack. And look at this. We got some nether quartz. We'll definitely need a lot of them um, in order to build a storage room, because I believe four nether quartz... Um, We'll, um, we'll make just one quartz block, I believe. Or maybe four. I don't know. I don't remember the crafting recipe exactly. But I'll get. But I'll gather a lot. Let me just see. Oh, yeah. Four nether quartz will make one nether quartz block. So I believe I'll need many stacks of them. Seeing that it's going to be built mostly out of nether quartz. I also do plan to have the floor. I'm not going to have the floor out of nether quartz. Um, just to save time. I'm actually going to have it out of sandstone. So, to, have to make it not look like a white building. Like a huge blob. Just all out of nether quartz. 
you know, I just want to have some variety in how I build my structures. Um, that's just that's just how I want to design my builds. And I do have 14 arrows on me in case if I counter gas battle. And Pigman, you gotta be careful with because if you um, hit one Pigman, they're all going after you. <laughs> anyway, so we just gotta be careful with Pigman. They're not hostile um, by themselves. They only attack you when you attack them. And not just the pigmen you attack, like all the pigmen in the surrounding area will, will try to kill you. So, unless if you got a full diamond armor, you're pretty much screwed. So, I did not bring potions because I do not have potions. Um, it would also be a good idea to gather some more resources, like glowstone. Um, I do have gunpowder um, inside the overworld. Alright, let's give Wisenit some... Oh, no, 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 no! My diamond sword! I'm not giving him my diamond sword. Anyway, we're just gonna... Give him some fish, maybe some pumpkin pie, and a few steak. I do not want to give him too many. Um, see, because I still need food. I'm going to be definitely using up some hunger bars. And I only got, oh, I got 42 nether quartz. It'd also be a good idea to mine some of this gold. Um, like I said before, gold <laughs> exists in nether, so... Um, I guess it's like an easy alternative um, to mining gold in the overworld. Right, I'm going to give Julia some of my fish, seeing that I have a lot of them. I don't, I didn't bring a whole lot, so I don't know, I'll only give her a few. I mean, it's really, it's really a matter of proportion, if you're trying to give it proportionally. I'm um, trying to sacrifice yourself for others, you know. Anyway, we're getting distracted. Uh, we are on a quest to mine nether quartz and gold. <laughs> but I do have plenty of gold in the overworld, so I don't know. I don't think it's my number one priority. This is my number one priority, getting quartz. I do hear a ghast somewhere. It looks like Wisenet is over there. I mean, I do not want to get too far. We do not want to get too far from each other because, you know, really, we do not want to... Um, encounter a gas battle or a blaze battle alone. That's just gonna end up someone dying. Unfortunately. What is this? I need blaze rods. Huh. Of course, we need blaze rods to make brewing stands. I, I don't remember most of the crafting recipes for brewing stands, so correct me if I'm wrong. Or making potions. It's been a long time since I've um, did brewing in Minecraft. I don't know. I just kind of phased out of it. I don't know, <laughs> um, what if I, you know, if I do more brewing, it would be the first time in quite a while since I've um, brewed potions. It would be cool, um, because it would be a nice experience again, and hello, Piglin. Alright, let's kill him. Good thing I have this full set of diamond armor. Not enchanted, though, but hopefully it should provide me some good protection from all of the mobs in another. I really love the new sounds. Listen to this. Like, walking on netherrack, mining it, like, netherrack and nether brick sound a lot different than they used to. They sound more robust and strong. So. <laughs> oh, wow. Listen to that mining sound for a little bit. Doesn't that sound um, robust looking or robust sounding? I guess it does. I mean, it's your opinion, guys. Anyway, we got oh a one and a half stacks of nether quartz. Ah, you know what? Let's not waste time. Let's just um, walk through this dimension trying to find as many quartz as possible, many stacks of them, and I hope Julia and Wisenet are doing the same thing, because I do not want to be doing this alone, I do, I really want them to take part in this, um, mining expedition in the nether. Any moment, this little gas, um, out of nowhere, fires a, um, a gas ball, or a fireball at me. It would just scare me like, ah! <laughs> anyway. Back to work.
it seems to me that for a long time, Netherrack is too easy to mine. Like, Diamond Pickaxe can mine um, this kind of stuff way too quickly. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hello. Oh, wait, I need food. I do not want to die. Be the worst possible time to die in the nether. I definitely don't want that to happen. There we go. Oh, come on. Yep, they're very annoying. <laughs> when it comes to this stuff, and I got gold boots, but they're about to break, so maybe not exchange them for my diamond gear. Oh no! Why is not it fell from a high place? That's terrible. Oh boy. That's bloody annoying. Yeah, dying in the nether is a lot worse than dying in the overworld. <laughs> I don't know what the hell just happened. Um, um... Unfortunately, that happens. Oh, his screen stopped. I don't know what's going on with Wise and its gameplay. It's definitely not a realm issue. It's definitely um, on his end that um, something happened. Like I'm, my gameplay is almost perfect. Like I'm getting a solid 60 frames per second. And I don't know what's going on with Wise and he must have be having a tough time with. Um, gameplay, but really it's no fun dying in another, because you have to, basically, the way you're going to get back to your death point is you have to get out of your bed, spawn point in the overworld, run to another portal, which I'm not sure how far it is, and then, and then go looking, um, scrambling to look for, um, your stuff, and it really, and really, your stuff can disappear in a matter of time, so... Yeah, it's like a close, um, it's like a race against time to retrieve your stuff before it disappears. Because I think, um, ground items do disappear after a given a certain amount of time in Minecraft. Especially at Diamond Gear, like, it's, it's definitely no fun. So, but at least it's not lagging on my end. But... I've died a lot of times in the nether, and to be honest with you, it it made me mad. <laughs> so, I don't know. Let's see. Oh, look, we have almost three stacks of nether quartz. That's good. Let's keep mining for this. Um, I don't know. I'm not sure how far. Yeah, this is why you do not want to be like far away from your from your mates. Like, um. Can someone give me blocks? Uh, oh, Julia's gonna help him out, so I guess I can continue working on mining all these nether quartz. Now look, some gold. I don't need that much gold. I uh, let's see. Oh, that's a little bit far. Maybe not. Uh, I don't know. We should go check him out. Check out him of what he's doing. I do not have any spare tools. Oh. He needs a few blocks to get his stuff. Uh, let's see. I don't think he's that far. I don't know where, I don't know where he is. Oh, let's try to teleport to... Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh, Wise, I'm here to help. Look. Netherrack. Here we go. Just to help you out. Thank you. Uh, how am I going to get back up? Yeah, I will need to pile my way back up. I don't know. Hopefully he didn't die that far from where I'm at. I just, I just hope he gets his stuff back because um, getting diamond gear, getting diamonds, and restarting all over again is not ideal. I definitely do not want to fall this time. Anyway, I, al and I also completed my barn house, so I've made a few changes um, with my barn. Um, I do have, um, so basically the way my barn looks, I'll show that to you towards the end of the video, or maybe in a separate video. But I complete my barn, um, so what's inside is animals, 
Um, I actually put cows on the second floor of the barn house. So I'll, I'll show it to you. I'll show you the barn house. Um, I don't know, maybe in a separate video since I'm doing this right now. It looks like we have a macro cube. But yeah, I also um, made a wheat farm and a sugarcane farm. Um, now to get some food supplies and to feed the animals. So yeah. I don't know, I guess the barn is a um, a great place to house all your animals because they are protected from the elements, you know. And this means that we can get an adequate supply of um, food, milk, wool, you know, all kinds of these essential, um, essential things that you need to survive in Minecraft. I also do have lots of sheep in my um, barn, so that I can get lots of wool to make carpets and that kind of stuff. And I also have a chicken coop. I decided um, to put a chicken coop, a little chicken pen, a uh, chicken coop where chickens would lay eggs. Basically the way it works, there's like a little um, block or section where I just put like a flowing stream of water. And this water basically carries all the chickens to the center. And below the chickens, um, on the floor, there are um, hoppers. There's a series of hoppers um, underground which carry the items to a chest which is outside. Um, so I guess it's like a pretty technical and efficient way to get eggs. Um, eggs n cannot just create um, cake. Um, they can also make pumpkin pie and make new chickens so you know but i feel like a few chickens is enough um will create an well over enough eggs um to make cake and that kind of stuff i don't know i hope my chest won't be a hundred percent full too quickly uh, i just want to find since i have um chickens laying eggs 24 7 <laughs> every five to ten minutes. I do need to find some use for these eggs, I just do not want them to go to waste. I don't know, last time I made a chicken coop in my other world that I showed you a few years ago, um, beginning of my YouTube channel, um, I had too many chickens which laid too many eggs and pretty soon easily filled too many chests as well. Um, so, I, so I do want to be uh, logical with how much I use. Or maybe not. I mean, Minecraft has an infinite supply of everything that you need. You can just go into creative mode and and get all the supplies you need. But we're not in creative mode. You know, we're, we're trying not to cheat. So, mine, mine, mine. <laughs> I think these are like emojis. I don't know how wise it displays that um, symbol or emoji on the chat. I might ask him how many stacks. We have almost four stacks of nether quartz. Just mine because you're border. <laughs> Lol. Uh, Alright. Well, I'm just going to have to get down. And I want to see what this um, little biome is, or big biome is. Um, since it's new, and I've been showcasing to my YouTube channel, look at this. Oh, look at that. Nice great texture. And it looks like it's snowing. <laughs> I, don't, I don't remember how many of the biomes. It's been a little bit while. What's this? What's, what's, the, what's this material? Basalt. Well, that's a weird name. <laughs> and what are these? I think these are the same materials, right? Yeah, basalt. What is this? Oh, boy. All right. Blackstone. Oh, I know what blackstone is. I've used it before. I guess this is like a nice source to get blackstone. You know what? I might get some of this blackstone, but I do want to be very, very careful because there's lots of lava everywhere. I do not want to die. So I just got to be very careful. You know what? I might as well block this off. There we go. I'm just going to block some of the lava off here. There we go. Yeah, it's nice to get some of this blackstone. This is, these are like... Um, new blocks they've added in the nether update, if you don't know. Anyway, 
back to mining. Oh look, macro cubes. Right here. Anyway, I'm getting way too distracted. I should be mining nether quartz, not killing magma cubes. Alright, looks like we have about four stacks of nether quartz. Yeah, we do need quite a lot of um, I'm gonna keep mining as much as I, I possibly can, maybe to the point where my inventory is almost full, because I'm not sure how much I'll need. I don't know, I'll tell them that I have over four stacks of nether quartz, how many do you guys have? Oh my goodness, that's a huge drop. Oh, two stacks, not bad. Not bad. How about Wise? How, how much did he mine? Two stacks isn't that bad. Maybe if we combine it all together. <laughs> Zero. <laughs> what happened? Was he um, not mining other quartz? Or... Oh, one and a half. Oh, that's, that's pretty good. So, I don't know. Another quartz seems to be um, hard to access for some reason. If there were more, I'll probably have more nether quartz. Just want to make sure there's no piglins. Oh, get out of my way, pigman. Do not knock me off that, into that void. He's just chatting something that I will not understand. I don't know. I'm not sure how much I'm going to need. Um, so I guess I'm going to end the video here. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe for more content. And also, I, for I almost forgot. We, I will be opening. This realm will be open to... Um, new players that want to join so if you want to um, join this realm be a part of this YouTube channel um, leave a comment down below I'm um, stating your minecraft username and I will decide um, whether whether to let you in or not anyway this is the end of the video hopefully you enjoyed it subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and I'll see you later bye